Hey, how's it going today? I just want to show you how to do something really fun and really quick. And this is how to get the vehicle into the open world. It's a lot more fun in here than in the template that it comes with. So to get started with this, we're just going to go to games. We're going to go into our blank project, which is the open world. And I'll just call this my project 31 because I have a ton of projects open already. And it just takes a minute to open up. Hey, I see Unreal Festival is going to be in New Orleans again. That seems like a lot of fun. Okay, so here we are in our open world. As I mentioned before, this is a mile and a half by a mile and a half world. So it's a big space. By doing this, this really opens up a world of possibilities for you. That's pun intended. Because you've got this whole world that you can throw a racetrack into and really create something special. A really cool game maybe even better than Grand Theft Auto. So what we're going to do is we're going to go add, add feature content pack, we're going to go to vehicle, and we're going to go add to project. And I think we're going to have to restart, but maybe not. It might ask you to do a restart or enable a plugin sometimes. If it does, just enable it. I think because I've already done this, it, it's not asking me for that. Now, it's not, nothing's going to happen right now if we hit play. Well, I cancel that. Blueprint failed to com compile. Hmm. I don't know why it did that. Blueprint compile error. Let's go into, let's see, why is it doing that? Plug in. Let's look for the chaos engine. Chaos. That Because that's what it was asking for last time. Oh, yeah. So you see this one chaos vehicle plugin. We need to enable that and do a restart. So let's go, it didn't message me that it needed that. Let's restart this. I'll just close, exit, launch. We'll just do that again. Well, I mean, this is life in the real world. I mean, this is the kind of stuff that happens sometimes. So I'm not editing out the failures. <laughs> let's see, what did I do there? Wait, cancel that. I want to do that again. I missed my, my project. I don't know how I missed the restart button on this. Just takes a minute. Okay. It was my project 31, this one. So let's see if it gives me a compile error. So it's just supposed to be you open the blank level and then you add the vehicle template to it. And then it might ask you to enable that plugin I just enabled. So I don't see an error. Let me hit play. I don't get an error. Okay. So this is where we were supposed to be. So now I'm just flying around in the world with my player controller, but I'm not in possession of any pawns or anything. So this is the player controller right here. This this really is the player controller. It's just like this omniscient force in the world, and it needs something to possess. So we'll just come over here, and we're going to go to Vehicle Advanced Game Mode. And I'll hit Play, and watch what happens. Look at that, my car falls out of the sky. Whoa, whoa, is this, is this Mars? Oh, here we go, there we go, look at that. And off we go. Wow, I'm taking some uh, bumps there. But I'm telling you, this is a lot more fun than, uh, you know, this is a lot more fun than uh, everywhere else, you know. There's my steering. It's just, and you got the your template here for a whole game now. Let me get on the gas and go. This is really relaxing, honestly. So I just wanted to share that with you, how easy it is to put your vehicle into the open world. And it's just a lot more fun in here. Anyway, if you found this helpful in any way, please subscribe. I'm trying to get to 5,000 subscribers by 2025. So thank you very much. Bye.